In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you one of my favorite cover two beaters from the Trips Tight End Offset in Madden 21. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Now if this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is all about how to become a better Madden player in Madden 21. And so if you are sitting there looking to get better at this game, I want to encourage you to click the subscribe button. We do videos every day that are designed to get you better on both the offensive as well as the defensive side of the ball. Um, and it's completely free to subscribe. That way you always know what is going on at the channel. You know whenever a new video comes out. So if you want to subscribe, um, it's completely free and you can do that at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Now in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a play that we broke down in our text message membership from the Trips Tight End Offset Formation. And if you wanna get um, my entire text message membership, I wanted to share with you kind of what it is and why it's valuable to you right now. Um, it's completely free. My text membership is and will always be completely free. It's basically just a simple way that I can connect with you guys on a weekly basis. And so what we do is every single week, for about one to two hours, I will sit down and I will break down an entire offensive or defensive scheme. So in the past, we've broken down schemes like the big nickel over G, the nickel, the, the cover four quarters defense. We've broken down the trips tight end. We've broken down the bunch tight end, the bunch, the trips tight end offset is one of those formations that we've broken down as well. And so we've broken down about 16 different schemes um, throughout the course of the season so far, and we add a new one to it every single week. And so if you want to get that video or that entire playlist sent to you every single week, all you have to do is send me a text message. Now, when you text me, what I want you to do is I want you to text the word Madden to my cell phone number, which is 208-218-6900. I'm going to put my number in the description as well in case you need to be able to go back and look at it. But that's all you gotta do. And what's gonna happen is I'm gonna respond to you, I'm gonna send you the playlist that has all of the schemes that we've done in the past, and it will also be updating that playlist and sending that to you every single week. And then if you have any Madden questions in general, you can always connect with me via text message, you can text me your questions, and I will get back with you as soon as I possibly can. So that's what my text message membership is, and that's how you can sign up for it. Now, what I wanted to do today is I wanted to share with you one of the few, or one of the many uh, videos that we've done in there, and that's the Trips Tight End Offset Formation. This formation is a lot of fun to run um, because it is very balanced. You can run the ball, you can pass the ball at a very high level out of this formation. And the play we're gonna be going over today is the X under uh, concept, passing concept. You know, I'm gonna be sharing with you this um, as it pertains to it being a cover two beater. Okay, so defensively, I'm gonna run some Tampa two here and the adjustments are actually relatively simple. All we're going to do is we're going to simply put the X receiver, which is your tight end on a streak route. And then from there, we can pretty much do whatever we want. What I like to do on the left-hand side of the field is I typically will go ahead and just simply streak the square receiver and smart route the triangle receiver. I'll probably actually fade him, I apologize. I'll probably actually fade that square receiver and then smart route that triangle receiver. That way, if they're playing kind of default cover two, then the square receiver will pretty much always get open. You'll see here, like if they're playing Tampa two, if I pass lead that square receiver to the left, you're gonna see that I'm gonna have a pretty decent little window to hit him. Now these are with 25 yard cloud flats on the outside, kind of a standard zone adjustment that a lot of people will use. If they're not using any zone drops, I'll show you that in a minute and how that beats the cover two. Now on the right side, the beauty of this is they don't, if they're not Mabel coveraging, you could hit that running back very, very easily. Um, the little table routes are super, super glitchy this year. Uh, table routes are super underrated in my opinion. If you can master learning how to throw a table route really, really well, um, it's gonna help your offense a ton. But let me show you kind of a standard cover two, you know, kind of Mabel coverage um, and just share with you kind of what's happening here. But this circle receiver is going to get into a very tender spot of the defense. Now I got uh, the throw out of sack stuff here. So let me clear that up a little bit. And, but that circle receiver is going to go into a position um, where he is going to have a very good opportunity uh, to be able to, you know, basically just get open. So again, let me show you this here. This is cover two and that circle receiver should get open against cover two. So we'll just snap the ball here, kind of get our pocket presence going on. And as you see right there, the circle receiver on the sideline over the top of that 25 yard 
cloud flat zone. Now that will also get over a 30 yard cloud flat zone. It will get over everything that the defense can do zone drop wise on this. This is a phenomenal little beater. Now the cool part is if you wanted to, you could actually motion this over as well. Um, so if I wanted to motion this guy right here, uh, I could do that. The problem is it, it doesn't have as much space to be able to get over the zone defense as it does if you leave it on the left side, okay? So I would just leave it on the left side and, you know, again, you're going to see very, you're going to have a lot of success with this. Now, on the left side of the field, let's talk about that for just a second. What you're going to notice is that this triangle receiver can be open for a little, um, kind of a little low ball on the cover two. And the triangle receiver is more of something that you want to run against cover four and cover three. Uh, but in, in this example here, like as long as you, I'm smart routing it, and that allows you to have a lot of control over it. You can un, basically when he cuts, I can low ball that um, as an easy little read against cover two. Now, if I let him run his default depth, um, what you would see here. So I'm just going to let him kind of run his default depth. You're going to see that he's going to be running right into the cloud flat. It's going to be very difficult for them for him to be able to get open. And so that's why you want to smart route him. It gives you a lot more control over where he goes. Now, let's say, for example, they're running some type of cover three on you. Uh, if they are running cover three, you're going to be able to hit this triangle receiver on the sideline pretty easily. Um, it's a very consistent little read against cover three and cover two or and cover four. And then as far as man coverage goes, uh, with man, when it comes to man coverage, this play is specifically designed for zone coverage. But that triangle receiver will sometimes get open right there. He didn't get that good, good, good of separation. But if we were to put Devontae Adams there with the route tech ability, he would probably have a lot more of an opportunity to be able to be successful um, as far as the man coverage goes. If you face a lot of man coverage, then my recommendation would be to put the triangle receiver on a slant route and just motion him over. You still have the same concept on that other side as far as getting you know, good separation against that cover two. And even that circle receiver, when he cuts to the inside, it's gonna do a good job against beating man. But this now gives you kind of an additional player um, you know, you could even do that with Devontae Adams if you wanted to kind of create a little bit of a doubles uh, style play here. But if you take a look at this, um, you can see that motion slant's going to get open. It's going to be very consistent for you against man-to-man, -man, um, especially with the AP changes and mud, lack of ability to be able to, you know, play great solid defense. But anyways, that's how you beat cover two. That's how you beat cover three from the trip side and offset. The trip side and offset is a phenomenal, phenomenal offensive scheme. And if you want to get it right now for free, it's a, I've got about an hour and 15 minute tutorial on this offense. All you have to do is text the word Madden to my cell phone number, which is 208-218-6900. I'm going to leave my number in the description. Thank you for watching this video, and I'd encourage you to hit me up via text message if you have any questions.